Today's story is about a pig and a crow, but it's really about taking a good look at yourself before judging others. Hello everyone, I'm Emily, welcome to my channel. Here is where I tell a lot of stories about Chinese idioms, and I really wanted to squeeze in a story about a pig before the year the pig is over, because we're about to enter a new year, the year of the rat, and I feel like the pig just doesn't get enough spotlight in Chinese culture. So here's a story that involves a pig, and it's kind of China's response to the English idiom, a pot calls the kettle black. Once upon a time, there was a crow and he was chilling on a tree. And he looks below and sees this really big black pig. And he screams at this pig, ha, look at this pig. He looks so dirty. And this poor pig, who's just minding his own business, looks around, finally sees this crow chilling above, and he says, oh, it's just a pathetic little crow. Now this crow gets offended and he shouts back at the pig, who do you think you're calling filthy? Have you even taken a good look at yourself? And the pig responds, um, have you taken a good look at yourself? After a string of arguing back and forth, the crow and the pig decides to go to a nearby pond so they can check out their reflection. And after looking at their reflection and taking a detailed look at each other, they got real quiet for a while. The crow finally happily says, uh, there's really nothing wrong with having a dark coat. And the pig happily responds, yeah, I think black is actually a really good look on us. That is where this story ends. I think the biggest takeaway from this short story is really take a good look at yourself before you judge others. A lot of times we see qualities in ourselves that we might not like and so we project this hatred for ourselves onto other people. But like most of the theme in my idioms, it's about having compassion and understanding for others it's really important to learn to accept and respect one another. I hope you guys enjoy the story. The next video that will come out will be in the year of the rat, so stay tuned for more rat-related idioms. Thank you guys for tuning into my channel as always, and I'm really looking forward to reading your comments because I love it when you guys share stories and anecdotes from your life because it helps everybody learn more about ourselves and just about the world in general. Thank you everyone for your contributions, and I will see you in the year of the rat.